I'm Evan, and today I'm going to be impersonating Odom Makes. Today I'm going to be making Ink, one of my own fan-made characters. Now, the thing I'm going to be making Ink out of is buttons. Now, Ink is going to be a mostly tricky character. Since he's mostly made out of black, and, well, I don't have a whole lot of black. I decided to use this as my first black color, since, you know, it's the blackest. So all I need is his yellow eyes. I don't have a whole lot of yellows, and this one seems to be the closest to the smallest yellow I can find. And I have way too many big yellows, such as this thing. We don't need that. This is a big ass button. Oh wait, I'm stupid. His other eye's orange. So, all you have to do is use this one. No, that's that's too small. This one. We use the same brand, same kind. Maybe same kind. Yeah, that one. That one will do. So now all we need are the other black pieces. That can serve as his body. And these two can serve as his feet. This one's a little chewed up, so I'll just use this one. Back into the box for you. Oh yeah, I need arms. Could be used. Now I kind of want to stay as close to the other pieces as I can. This one. Yeah, this one works. I'll use these two for another project. Besides, these look more like eyes than hands and stuff, so I'll just use that for another project. Oop, that's the wrong way. So as I wait for the glue to set up, I just stand here and wait. Yeah, just before I um make the other one, I just wanted to show this little Isaac one that I made. Yeah, this one. Oh, and I just need to reposition my feet. I think it's cool. It's a uh, well, it's it's um. <laughs> I haven't made bead things in a long time, not bead things, button things in a long time, so I just decided, hey, why not make this? Alright, so the glue should be cut off right now, so what first we're going to do is we're actually going to put on the eyes. So let's do that. Alright. Right now we're going to put the... It's orange on the left. All right. Yeah, right now we're just gonna have a put a little bit of glue right here. I actually need to see this with my own eyes, so I'm just gonna have it off to the side a bit. And put glue right in here. Now that should be enough. Ah, fucking tether, tether lines. And place it right about here. Ooh, yay, we just round up, which means we have enough. I'll fix that later. Oh, shit. And now we do the same with this eye. I hate these. Alright, there we go. I hate the fucking hot glue lines. I put this way too close. So let me, let me just fix that. There we go. I could not move the orange, so screw it. You know, if I ever wanted to do another Isaac, I could have done the, uh, I could do the, um, the Isaac where he gets like the species thing, like the little, 
like a thing that calms people down and you like squish and the eyes pop out that kind of thing all right next we're going to be doing the head we're going to be doing the body so we just put a little bit of glue there and make sure that everything's away and set it all up make sure this is properly uh, prop early propped up any excess in there we go I have to get all this shit off my hands now what we do is we put a little dab on here in the side Somehow, I knew that wasn't going to work out. Let me put that right there. Now what we're going to do right here is we are going to put a little more glue right here in the seam so that, it sh so that way it does stay. I didn't, I didn't really have enough room, but yeah, that's good enough. Yeah, there. All we have to do is remove the excess. And now we do the same with the other hand. Now, what we're going to do with the legs is we're actually going to make him look like he's running or walking or whatever. So, we just put a little dab of glue right here. We out the excess string and place it like so. I do this because there's never usually enough room on the front. So, the eye coming off. Which means we need more on the eye, so. There we go. No, this one's gonna be. Oh god, he looks derpy as fuck. All right. There, there we go. Now his left eye is going to be. I mean, his right eye is going to be fragile because it's not really centered that good. But now all we have to do is get rid of the extra string on the back and put on the back leg. Now his legs right there, so his back leg will go right here. I'm shaking this a lot because I'm holding to shake the uh, hot glue, and I don't usually do this so down low. And we place it there. Scoop off the excess. And there we go. One premium little ink. Ink is a. Uh, Ink is one of my favorites. He was actually one of the first uh, ink demons that I made. Now he actually has a little brother called Slime. Ink and Slime, yeah. Now if you guys want to see me make slime, uh, there's going to be a, a pole r r right up here somewhere. Up, uh, right here, or right here, probably right here. But anyway. Gonna no, be right here, somewhere up here. Anyway, there's gonna be a pole uh, up there asking which um, which little bead figure. Oh, God damn it! I keep calling them beads. Little little button figures you want me to make next? Yeah, I already made a few Five Nights at Freddy's ones, like Mangle, uh, Freddy, Foxy, and Chica, and. Uh, Crazy Koopa, link down in the description below. He made me a little Freddy, which gave me the idea to make these little guys. So anyway, if you want to see more, keep these guys there. If you guys want me to see, make more uh, 
bead figures. And then put a like on this video, subscribe if you haven't already. And again, pull right up here. And in case you guys didn't know, if you haven't gone to the poll already, then yes, slime will be one of the candidates. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Heaven, death, and love, and birth, and peace, and war on the planet.